What rich soup usually has a milk base except for the Manhattan variety when it's made with tomatoes? Uh, cream of tomatoes. In 1891, Whitcomb Judson took out a patent on the slide fastener, later called what? Oh, oh man. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Beth, sorry. What is the term for piping through which secretions leave a gland or heat leaves a furnace? Uh, exfiltration. What was the first country to use paper money? Uh, first country. What well, path? According to author Ray Bradbury, at what temperature does paper burn? Uh, uh, uh. In 1891, Whitcomb Judson took out a patent on the slide fastener, later known as a what? A uh, zipper. What was the first country to use paper money? China. According to author Ray Bradbury, at what temperature does paper burn? Oh, jeez. Uh, uh, 400, uh, 400 degrees? Time. All right, Mark. Hold on. A hard time hearing Mark a couple times. Yeah. Wave in hot wings, will you? Yep, he's coming. Hot wings, welcome back. Hot wings, you ready? Mark is on hold. Almost. Yeah. Now I'm ready. $300 could be his. Could be. Or it could not be. Your turn, Hot Wings, begins in three, two, one. What rich soup usually has a milk base except for the Manhattan variety, which is made with tomatoes? Uh, chowder. In 1891, Whitcomb Judson took out a patent on the slide fastener, later called a what? A zipper. What is the term for piping through which secretions leave a gland or heat leaves a furnace. A pass. What was the first country to use paper money? Oh boy, China. According to author Ray Bradbury, at what temperature does paper? Burn? 451 degrees. What is the term for piping through which secretions leave a gland or heat leaves a furnace? A duct. Time. Welcome back. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi. Hi, hi, Mark. Hi, Mark. Let's answer this, or score this, I should say. What rich soup usually has a milk base except for the Manhattan variety, which is made with tomatoes? Owing said chowder. Mark said cream of tomato. The answer is chowder, clam chowder, correct? One to nothing. In 1891, Whitcomb Judson took out a patent on the slide fastener, better known as a what? Hot Wings said zipper. Mark said zipper. Zipper. Two to one. What is the term for piping through which secretions leave a gland or heat leaves a furnace? Hot Wings said duct. Mark said... Uh, <laughs> what did you say, Mark? <laughs> it's wrong, but exfiltration. Exfiltration. That's, that's right. I didn't know it. I, yeah. I forgot to write it down, and I thought I'll remember that because I don't. Nope. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, it's a uh, duct. Yeah. It's of the two, it's duct, <laughs> not exfiltration. <laughs> no one has a tear exfiltration or. Yeah. Oh man, I could hear somebody banging on my heating exfiltration. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I guess it's uh, hey, what exfiltrating do I know? the uh, duct work. <laughs> yeah. Uh, three to one hot wings. What was the first country to use paper money? You both said China. And you're both right. Really? Yeah. I can't believe we both said it and we're right. You both said <laughs> China. Wow. According to author Ray Bradbury, at what temperature does paper burn? Hot Wings said 451 degrees. He knew it. Mark said 400. The answer is Fahrenheit 451. Correct. Hot Wings wins. Five to two. That's an old-fashioned ass kicking, Mark. Uh, there was nothing you could do to contain me today. Uh, a, a quick correction. Um, 
Hot Wings won four to one. I cannot accept cl a chowder because apparently there are lots of types of chowder, there including are. clam. So Hot Wings that wins. That is true. That's actually why I only said chowder because I was afraid if I said clam, you'd say too specific. <laughs> so, but other way All around, right, it fine. Would have been, I'll take it. Just the right amount of specific. Thank you, Mark. Yeah.